Hi, welcome to Motivational Monday. Today I want to talk about Nicole's Network and what it stands for, what we're doing, just so you guys can get a better understanding of what the brand stands for and the direction that we're going as well. Um, you may not know. And so this is my chance to explain to you um, what it is that we do and what it is that we can do for you. So the first thing I want to start off with is Motivational Monday, um, which is what you So thank you for tuning in. Um, Motivational Monday started probably a year and a half ago. I did take a break for a little bit and then revamped it recently. What it is to me is a chance to challenge some of the taboo topics in our society and things that people really don't talk about and a chance to talk about it, to be honest with you. Um, I believe that the topics that we keep seeing as taboo or that we're experiencing as taboo really shouldn't be, and that we should be able to talk about the things that are impacting us, whereas now we're in a, a time in our society, and I don't even know, if maybe it's always been that way, but no one likes to talk about the struggles that they're going through. No one likes to talk about the problems, the the bad days. All we like to do is publicize all the good that's happening and then you suffer in silence. And to me, I think that's where a lot of some of the, um, and all of that really comes from by not feeling comfortable to be open and honest and say, hey, listen, I'm not okay. And for some reason, the people in our world um, and in our in our environment, they, they don't really wanna hear it. When you ask someone, hey, how are you? Oh, I'm good. Okay, but are you? And how many people are actually answering those kind of questions honestly? And how many people questions wanting the truth? And, and it's, it's really unfortunate because then you have instances where it just builds up to the point where you just can't look past it anymore. And I think that's when we end up seeing the breakdowns that you see because we're not able to communicate that and communicate honestly with people. So some of the topics that I like to discuss on Motivational Monday include um, bettering yourself, um, for one, as well as issues that I've dealt with personally, whether it's depression or suicide or even talking about miscarriage. As I suffered through my miscarriage with twins, I realized people don't talk about it. Everyone talks about the kids that they have. Everyone talks about, oh, my kid did this, and oh, my kid did this. But it wasn't until I started being open and honest about my miscarriages that I realized everyone who brags about their kids all day long have also suffered. Well, not everyone, but a lot of people, more than you realize, have suffered through um, either loss or struggle to conceive or whatever the case, but no one talks about it. And it literally wasn't until I started being open and honest with people that they were like, oh yeah, we dealt with that too. Oh yeah, we had that issue. Oh, I'm so sorry. And it's the same people who brag about their kids all day long. Why are we so afraid to be honest with people about what we're going through? It's just not a healthy scenario. So that's part of the mo the video blog every Monday. Every Monday. If you have not subscribed to the YouTube channel, please do so that you get the notifications. And I want you guys to chime in on the conversation. So then you have Thoughtful Thursday. This is a new written blog that I have every Thursday. It is partnered with Apple News. Um, so you can actually read them there as well as on my website, Nicole'sNetwork.net. Thoughtful Thursday is kind of like a how-to guide um, to just various topics that I feel like are helpful um, for the millennials who are just trying to figure out life. I don't pin myself to be an expert. I'm just sharing what I've learned because I feel like that's how we grow as a people is by everything that we learn and being able to share that with someone else. And so that's the goal of Thoughtful Thursday. Um, overall and between Motivational Monday and Thoughtful Thursday whether you like the video blogs where you can actually hear me talking or the written blogs where you know you're just reading something really quickly whatever uh, preference you have 
both are available now. Also, um, we have novels. So my very first book is coming out December 2nd. It is available available for pre-order now at a discounted rate and you get a signed copy. Um, what that book is, it's really <sighs> challenging every taboo topic you can think of. It's Motivational Monday was talking and discussing about the details and the specifics of the books. Um, but just really briefly, if you missed that video, um, it's basically about depression, um, growth, feeling like, what now? What do I do with myself now? And kind of going from there. Um, and also just life and trying to figure it all out and all that fun stuff. Only make sure you pre-order the book. Um, I think it's definitely going to help people. Um, the reviews that I've gotten from the book has been honored. Like I'm honored that people think that the book is as good as they say it is. And it's really helpful for people who are like us that are still tr trying to figure it out. Like I feel like our 20s and 30s are so confusing. And it's really just um, a chance to see that you're not the only one who is like, going to be okay. We'll, we'll get through it somehow. Also, we do workshops. Um, we do a Loving Me uh, workshop series. Uh, we So far, we've done the Loving Me 2017. We did Financial Freedom. And then around New Year's, we will have one on physical health. Because um, let's be honest, people... Uh, Everyone wants to lose weight for their New Year's resolution. So I have a couple of fitness specialists who are going to come out and show us how to do it the best. So that one is coming. And then also we'll be doing other things um, along down the line as well. Um, but the workshops are definitely a chance to kind of get that in-person connection. And I bring out a lot of specialists on my, on my workshops because I really do want you guys to have the best information available to you. I also do development coaching. I have a five week development boot camp. Um, in that we talk about four very key areas, financial freedom, spiritual growth, physical health, and then the fifth week is kind of like a recap week. And in this, you get that one-on-one -on -one accountability, you get guidance and development, and I can put you in contact with whatever specialist you do need for those areas. Uh, and being able to guide you through to a better version of yourself. So if you're ready for better days, I recommend that you sign up for your free consultation um, so we can just figure out what's the best route for you and understanding what is the best case scenario for you. So with all of that, I want to hear from you guys. How can I best serve you? What is it that I can do um, with that being the pretense um, that can help you grow and help you be a better person and help you understand that you're not and that you do have somebody in your corner cheering you on and i do want to share with you all um the mission statement and maybe that'll help you understand kind of where we come from as a company from a company's perspective so i'm committed to serving others through my personal testimony I believe that if my pain can benefit even just one person, that it was worth suffering through. I hope to inspire others to consistently work towards self-development and find the freedom in the most authentic version of themselves. So if anything that I've just said has resonated with you, I urge you to contact me. Um, I am going to put my email address on there, um, on the comments. and. I really want to hear from you guys. Like, what is it that I can do to fulfill my mission statement, to encourage others to find the best version of themselves, to constantly work towards self-development and self-improvement so that you can be a better you? And I really feel like the more people I help with struggles that I've been through, honestly and really and truly, it makes it feel like it was worth it. It was worth going through. Um, so help me help you. All right. Thanks, guys.